This is a giant industrial feedlot. And this is a drone. Uh, this might fly like anywhere, so you might want to back up like a lot. Take a look at this. Thousands of pigs live inside of these structures. They never see the sky or feel the warmth of the sun until they walk this ramp onto the truck that will take them to the slaughterhouse. These are not farms. Those places barely exist anymore. Most animals used for food are raised on massive industrial facilities like these. This is what a California dairy really looks like. Great cheese comes from happy cows. Happy cows come from California. And this is the lie they've been feeding us for years. Most cows used for milk in California are crowded by the hundreds or thousands in dirt lots. To obtain the cow's milk for human consumption, their newborn babies are taken away. And those babies are put into boxes, which are so small that they can barely move. Sometimes, they're right next to the cesspools of their own waste. I thought I'd seen the worst of it, until I saw this. Dozens of bodies of dead pigs dumped into an open pit. As I went to more pig facilities, I saw these again, and again, and again. They even have a name, Dead Piles. This isn't a normal city, and these aren't normal houses. Here, millions of birds live in hundreds of buildings owned by many different companies, producing massive numbers of eggs to be shipped far and wide. We lowered the drone near one of these structures and saw thousands of animals caged on top of each other, confined so tightly they could barely move around. Another investigator went inside and recorded this footage. The birds live in these conditions for over a year. The investigator found many individuals caught in the cage wires and unable to reach water. Some had died of thirst in this situation. And the egg city is growing, with more and bigger buildings under construction 